Hey everyone, David here with Headset Advisor. Hope you're doing well today. In this video, we are gonna do a review of the new Yealink WH67 wireless headset that you see in front of me here. This is like a mobile command center for your UC applications. This headset connects to your uh, Yealink desk phones or other USB desk phones, your computers, your mobile devices, it even has a built-in uh, speaker phone here. It's convertible, but we're gonna cover all those details in this video. We are also going to test the microphone, how much noise canceling and what it sounds like, as well as the speaker, so you can see for yourself how this headset sounds. So let's get started right now. All right, let's take a quick look at the specs of this headset. Okay, it has eight hours of talk time. It has a wireless rating up to 394 feet of wireless range. It has uh, Bluetooth 4.2 built into the base to connect to your mobile phones and also Bluetooth enabled desk phones. You have uh, USB charging on the side of the base here. And of course, you have ability to add on accessories like a um, charging stand or a busy light. And it utilizes DECT 6.0 wireless technology. It has a uh, two year warranty and an MSRP price of just over $300. All right, now let's take a quick look at the earpiece here. As you see, this is a small uh, earpiece, very uh, small design. It has this earbud here. It also comes with a whole variety of earbuds and ear hooks to find the perfect comfort level for you. They have a kind of touch sensitive uh, part of the headset here, so increase, decrease volume just when you slide your finger. Then you have your uh, answer button on or off and you also have your mute button here, that red button, so uh, that it's easy to find. And if you look at the dock here, it's pretty sophisticated. It, uh, the headset just drops right into the cradle and it just has a nice, elegant design. And you have this touch screen and when using the touch screen, I find that it's uh, very intuitive, very easy, it works well. Other headsets with screens in the past were a bit clunky and didn't work right, but this one, uh, just seems to just, as soon as you touch it, it works kind of like a phone would work, very easy. Uh, it has the speaker phone that I showed you. We're going to test it later on in this video, as well as the microphone on the headset. But this is like a, uh, uh, a command center for your UC applications. You can connect up your uh, a charging stand to this port on the side of the headset here. Let me see if I can get this open. So there's this port special to Yealink here that you just add in this charging stand. Now your phone can charge on it. So that is a nice feature to have. Then also you can add in a online indicator. So this is called a busy light. It just plugs into the back of the charging base. So then when you're on a call, uh, this turns on. I'm not connected up to anything yet, so it doesn't know that it's on yet, but we will show you that here shortly, which is another uh, convenient thing to be able to add. Again, this is an optional accessory, and same with the charging stand is an optional accessory. Then you have USB hub on the side here, so you can use this just to plug in any other USB 3.0 device. And then you have your USB connection on the bottom here. So that's your standard PC connection. Okay, so now let's get to the fun stuff. Uh, let us uh, get to testing the microphone and the speakers, but let me show you before we do that, let me show you what comes inside the box so you get a better idea of what's inside. Of course, you have your little quick start guide here. All right, so you have a headband option. 
You have a neckband option. And it comes with USB-A to USB-C in case you're connecting to like a Mac or a computer with only a USB-C. Then you have a USB 3.0 to USB uh, 3.0. That's how you're gonna connect to your computers. And then you have your different earbuds here. And they even put it in this nice traveling case. Keep your earbuds protected and let me just get this stuff out of the way. All right, so let's take a look at these earbuds here. So there's quite a uh, variety of options available to you. In addition, you can wear an ear hook. That helps to just um, make the headset a bit more stable if you're finding that the earbud isn't cutting it for you. All right, so let's put that to the side. Now let's get to the fun stuff and let's get to testing the microphone. So I'm gonna pause the video and then hook it up to the computer so we can uh, test it out. Okay, now this is the Yay Link connected to the computer. As you can tell, my voice is coming through this microphone here. This is what somebody's going to sound like on the other end of a phone call or Zoom meeting, uh, that type of thing. So we're gonna keep talking here for just a few more seconds. Um, all right, so what we're gonna do next is we are going to play some office ambient noise so you can get an idea of how much noise is canceled if you have that type of noise in the background. So let's get that started. Okay, now uh, the audio is being recorded directly through the DSLR Rode mic camera. And this is how loud it is in the background with the office ambient noise playing. Now this is with it on the Yay Link WH67 with the same office ambient noise going on in the background. We're just going to let that play for just another couple seconds here so you get a good idea of how this microphone sounds. What we're going to do next is we're going to test the speaker so you can see how much noise is coming out of this uh, speaker so you can get an idea of what it would sound like if you're listening to music or a podcast, that type of thing. All right, so let's get started on that. All right, so what we're going to do here is I have this Rode mic connected to the camera and we are going to put the speaker directly over that microphone so you can get a, a good idea of the sound quality of this uh, speaker. Go ahead, Jeff, go ahead and play the music here. How did the wireless WH67 perform for you? Put it in the comment section below. Would love to get your feedback about that. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna test this speakerphone to see how it performs as well. So what we're gonna do is actually, um, my voice is being recorded directly through this speakerphone right now. So you can hear what that sounds like. And then what we're gonna do is we are going to uh, play music out of the speaker so that you can hear what that sounds like. Now, before I do that, so what happens is maybe your headset died. You forgot to put it on the charger or you're just, you know, talked over the eight hour talk time on this headset. Boom, you put the headset back onto the dock. Now you're using this speakerphone right away. So Jeff, go ahead and play the music and this is what it would sound like coming through the speaker. So there you go. I mean, it's not the best overall audio experience. It's not the best, you know, bass or, you know, a Bose speaker, but that is going to uh, definitely be loud enough and sufficient enough that you're going to be able to finish up your conversation if you're in, uh, or even you just don't want to wear your headset and you're in a Zoom meeting and, you know, somebody, of course, is dragging on like always, you can just put them on speaker, zone in on whatever work you need to do, and keep it moving. So, 
that is that. Now what I wanna do is I wanna show you what is up with this uh, screen here. It's very powerful, it's uh, unique and cool. So let's take a look at it. I switched it from the Teams version, which this is what it came out of the box, to the UC version, which it just allows, uh, if you're in Teams version, you can optimize with your Microsoft Teams. You'll get your notifications, status updates, call control for Teams. And it's very convenient for somebody who uses Microsoft Teams by the Microsoft Teams version. And it's just right out of the box, plug and play, ready to go for your Microsoft Teams. All right, now take a look at this screen here. So you have um, settings, uh, let me go back. So there's a couple of icons, the Bluetooth, the phone, and also uh, the settings here. So we're gonna go into settings, go to basic settings. You can set the language. Bluetooth is off, so if you wanna pair a mobile phone, I'll do that right now here for you. So cl just click this on, go into your phone, Go into your Bluetooth. All right, so it says look for Yay Link WH67, which came up on my phone here. Now it's connected. It's really that easy, that simple to do that. So let's go back. Go back here. So you can add another headset if you have a team of people with these headsets. You could add a secondary one to this base. Um, you can set your, your backlight to always on, screensaver, theme. You can change it from you know light to dark. Uh, you could have it uh, ringtones come on. You could have dial tone for when you're... Um, um, when you select like a, a new phone call, I'll show you what that looks like here. So when you when you set up a new call, so let's say this is a soft phone. So if you have Microsoft Teams, you could dial somebody's phone number directly from here, and then it's going to have your dial tone set up for you. So you'll you'll know that you're having a call, um, just like this. If I want to do a cell phone call, just do it right from this touch screen, which is pretty cool. All right, let's go to advanced settings. So you can set the wireless range to long. So it's set up right out of the box to long. That gives you your, for this model, it's gonna give you 394 feet, but you could switch that to medium and short if you wanted to. All right, voice announcements, uh, mute reminder. So this is where you can change the platform from Teams to UC. It's just a simple switch. So that's pretty powerful that you can do that right from the base without downloading extra software. Just simply, switch it to Microsoft Teams and you can convert a UC model to a Teams model or the other way around. All right, so there's all these other, uh, you know, features that you can change right there on the charging base. So I just wanted to show you the, the touch screen, the capabilities of it, really cool device that, um, you know, has a lot of functionality right out of the box. All right, now what I wanna show you is <clears throat> how to change the uh, different wearing styles. So right now I have it set with the ear hook and also the earbud, but you can, there's four different ways of setting this up. As you see, this has a, let me see if I can get that to focus here. All right, it has kind of like this plus design and all of the accessories have that same plus design. You just gotta match it up and then rotate it. And then same thing with the earbud. You just have to match up the plus. It's actually three. So once it's matched up, you just push it on and that's how easy it is to switch that. So now let me, whoop, let me do that for, and you can wear this earbud. I did it with just this earbud and it's surprisingly very comfortable and stayed in place. The headset's extremely lightweight, so it's gonna be comfortable for all day use. All right, so that is the headband there. Super easy, you can wear it on the right ear, left ear. It's got the leather ear cushion, adjustable headband. Uh, let's see if I can figure out how to get it off. All right, and then you have the neckband. This seems to be uh, the less preferred option for most people but you do have it available to you. 
So you can set it up like that. And then you put on your ear cushion here so that you have that ready to go and you got the neck band. So it's that easy, that simple, and that convenient to switch out the wearing styles. All right, so I hope you enjoyed this overview. Very quickly here, this headset is like a UC um, command center. It connects your mobile phones, your uh, soft phones, and can connect your also your Yealink desk phone all in one device. Has a built-in speaker phone. You heard for yourself the audio quality. Um, you know, of both of these things, it is a very powerful headset at a uh, surprisingly affordable price for all the features you get. The touch screen, the speakerphone, noise canceling microphone. There's a lot to like about this headset. So if you're interested in this headset, make sure to check it out on the link below and use coupon code YouTube for the best deal possible that we offer on this headset. So make sure to do that. It's available right now. Um, we also have it available for rent if you want to get it for just, you know, a few bucks a month. So it's definitely worth uh, considering if you're looking for a new headset. Overall, this is a um, great wireless headset that uses DEC 6.0. It's going to be a lot better than Bluetooth devices because you're going to get a lot more range. And you heard the sound quality for yourself. It's convertible, so that means you can wear it over the head. Over, uh, behind the neck or over the ear like you see here and it gives if you're buying this headset for somebody or just yourself It gives you so many different options to be able to wear this headset. So you're gonna find a um, Wearing style that's comfortable for you. No problem. They also sell this in a mono and a duo version So if you just know you like a headband in single speaker or dual speaker, they have that option available as well it's called the WH-66, and then you just either get a mono or a duo. And I did an uh, in-depth review of both those headsets. I'll, um, you can check them out on our channel, or I'll put a link in the video description below. Uh, you can check them out. Other than that, I hope you really enjoyed this video. If you got any value from it, make sure to use that link again to purchase this headset and use coupon code YouTube. Hit that thumbs up button and subscribe. You know what that really does? It helps other people see this video and learn about it, and we would greatly appreciate it if you would uh, do that. It helps spread the word. Well, that's all I got for now. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Thanks a lot for tuning in.